Hey guys, what's up? How y'all doing? I'm here to talk to you guys about One Piece's new episode, which is on episode 1050. This episode right here was really nice and slick. Looking forward to the next one, so if anything else, let's just get this started. We had to it that freaking, like, um, Luffy arrives with Momonosuke and Yamato and Luffy make their attack on Kaido, you know? Eventually, Kaido enters his dragon form, etc., and we get to see a scene, scene switch with, like, um, the long nose guy and Otoko. Otoko, you know? Well, I, I don't remember that guy's name. Forgive me. All I know is, is like, um, he has a long nose and it's on a mask, you know, that kind of thing. So, that much I can say. We get to see him thinking about the situations about Otoko and then reminiscing about Yasui, you know, that kind of thing. Yada, yada, yada. But that aside, um, yeah. So, pretty much, like, um, we have to it that he remembers about how Otama ends up going to Onigashima to go help out everyone else, you know? Which I thought it was pretty something cool here and there, although he did not want her to go because it was too dangerous. But she insisted to go anyway, and I thought it was pretty cool. That aside, um, we have to it that um, Queen and everyone else realize the pink dragon is actually Momonosuke. We have to it that, like, um, we see Inugarashi and Nekomomoshi clash against their own opponents, you know? Like Nekomomoshi against, um... Against like um Lickly Lickly Peros Peril and you know Inigurashi against Jack, you know. Of course they do find their self at a good advantage when they enter their Sulong forms. However, they did not really stand much of a chance once they lose the moonlight, you know, which is covered by clouds, which is a big disadvantage and at the same time a nasty double edged sword. We all know how Sulong forms work, right? Because like um when Sulong forms come in, you know, they give you a big boost of power and electricity, yada, 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 however you want to call it. However, when you don't have it or something or you use it at a certain degree or for a while, it drains your stamina pretty badly, you know? Yeah, and so forth. And we have to, of course, Inigurashi is at a disadvantage and, you know, Nekomamashi gets pierced by a bunch of candy arrows, you know, that kind of thing. But that aside, we see to it that Kaido goes into his dragon form in this episode, and gets ready to clash against Momonosuke, saying we don't we don't need another dragon in this damn world, you know. And we see to it, Kaido makes an attack with Bolo Breath, but Momonosuke managed to dodge it. Luffy tells Momonosuke to bite Kaido when he has the t when he when it presents itself, you know. We have to it. Luffy uses Gear Third, punches Kaido to the ground, and Momonosuke ends up biting Kaido. And Momonosuke remembering uh, all the suffering and misery that he caused upon him and his father, and killing his mother and father, you know. He somehow wasn't afraid anymore, you know, which I thought it was pretty cool. And therefore, after, before Kaido was about to launch another ball of breath, Luffy gives him a fu I mean, <laughs> a freaking powerful hockey punch, enhanced hockey punch to Kaido's face, you know. And we have to it, of course, like, um, that Kaido falls to the ground, and then Luffy asks Momonosuke, like, Hey, good job, you bit Kaido whatsoever, and that's when everyone realizes that Luffy is alive and that he's well and still going, you know? And we see to it that eventually, um, that Luffy, let's see here, I mean, um, <laughs> that Momonosuke is no longer afraid after Luffy asks him a question, Hey, you bit an uh, emperor of the sea, are you... Is there any reason for you to be scared anymore? He goes, and Momonosuke replies, no, you know? Preview next episode, oh man, I can't wait to see that scene animated, etc. I hope they do a good job, you know? I mean, like, um, they did... They did, they did somewhat of a good job when it came to, like, Luffy making his clash against Kaido multiple times, you know? I mean, those times where he used, um, Hao Shoko no Haki infusion, and then, like, him clashing against him on the, the first time on Onigashima. Well, of course, that's, well, when on Onigashima, he clashes against Kaido using Red Rock, you know? That kind of thing. I look forward to see how they're gonna handle the next scene, which I look forward to tremendously. And... The next couple events after that, I look forward to it. So, yeah, until then, people, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm off of Zero. Have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time, alright? Peace out. Bye-bye. Toot-toot!